in 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 glue. Hi! It has been a very long time I haven't used any videos to introduce to you some grammatical items and that's why I'm going to use this video to talk about how to use when and while to put two events into one sentence. Of course, you know me, I'm not going to just tell you the rules. I'm going to use the hottest topic to introduce the item to you. What is the hottest topic recently? Three, two, one. Of course, that is Animal Crossing, right? It is such a smash hit when it came out and everybody, literally everybody was talking about it, buying this game and spending most of the time at home playing this game. Decide the island out of the imagination and I am no exception. I'm going to use this game today to introduce to you when and why. Before I do anything, of course, I want to introduce me to you. This is my character. <laughs> Isn't he cute? Very energetic, right? And you can see a lot of yellow flowers. Beautiful. Compared to a lot of players around the world, my island was actually really small, I would say. I only have a few villages, or you can say I only have a few friends on my island, and they are Bianca, the leopard, and Mira, the rabbit. She's always in her superwoman costume. I don't know why, but yeah, maybe that is her character. And we have Spyro here, a big gym fan. And also we have Blava, probably the only intellectual character in the whole game. Okay, you can see that he is holding a book on his hand and on his wing, to be accurate. And he also owns his own uh, a museum on the island too. In this video, I'm going to use these characters to introduce when and why. Let's start with Bianca. Bianca, just like most of the teenage girls, she cares so much about her body shape. And that's why whenever I saw her in a game, she was working out, okay? She was doing sports, just like this video. You see? Yeah, that's how they talk. Okay, I don't know why they do it. Yeah, and also in this video, you see, from morning to evening, she is still working out, okay? She really wants to keep fit. Uh, I appreciate this kind of effort and passion in it. If I want to describe the actions in these two videos, I am going to describe it like this. So the first one is Bianca was working out when I saw her. And the second one, still, Bianca was working out while I was watering my plants. Now you can see that both of them I start with Bianca was doing her workout, right? But something is different. For the first sentence, I use when, and the second one, I use while. Why is the difference? Can you tell? If you are observant enough, you should know that this part is not the same. Okay, let's go into the timeline. So basically, I can say that Bianca has been doing her workout for quite a long time already. Okay, and so I would call this a long action. We can call it a long action here. And then after a while, I suddenly bump into her. And so my action of seeing her is a relatively shorter action. So this, see her, is a short action. When we put two actions, one long and one short, together into one sentence, we will use when. How about the second one? Let's take a look. So again, as you know already, Bianca has been working out for quite a long time already, of course, from morning to evening, okay? But me watering the plants was also quite a long action, right? So, both of them are actually long action, I would say. Long actions, if you want to put these together, we will need to use while. 
let's look at one more example and this time it comes sparrow and also blava okay both of them are birds but they have very different habits okay for sparrow he always loves to move around making something on his own and in this video he is also doing something on his own Ta -da! he is making his own furniture sparrow was making some furniture i enter his home which one is a long action? Of course. Making the furniture was the long action because before I came into his home, he was already making the furniture, right? So that's one is a long action and me getting into his home, me entering his home is just a very short moment. And so I would say this one is long while this one is short. Okay, and again, if we need to put a long and a short action together, which one should we use? When or while? As you know already, when, right? So, Sparrow was making some furniture when I enter his home. Okay, it's very easy. How about a second one? I was visiting the museum and what are you doing, Blava? Yeah, sleeping. He is an owl. Of course, he has to sleep, okay? Me visiting the museum for some time already and he was still sleeping. Both of these actions are actually quite long, right? You can't just visit the museum for one minute, right? So it has to be a long action and Blava sleeping, also long action. So here we have Long, long action. Okay. Bava was sleeping. I was visiting the museum. We need to put them together, right? So we use while to put them together. Bava was sleeping while I was visiting the museum. Pretty simple. Of course. That's so easy. Now I'm going to give you a little quiz. Okay, to see whether you actually understand how to use when and why. Here are two videos consisting of four different actions. Let's take a look. Yeah, you see, I was fishing and there was a butterfly flying around me. So this time, which one is a long action? Fishing or the butterfly flying? Yeah, if you're smart enough, you should know. Both of them are long actions. So, a butterfly was flying around me while I was fishing. How about this one? Do you see Mira? This is her. Whew. One more, two more, three more. Okay. Which one is a long action? I caught the butterfly. Choo! Or Mira was stretching. Which one is the long action? Of course, Mira was stretching. It's a long action, right? If we have long and short together, then we will need to use when in the middle. So here you should see that when we have two long actions, when we have two long actions here, we use while. And if we have one long action and one short action, what should you do? We use when. Is that okay? Very easy. When do we use when? We use when when we want to put two events together. One long action and one short action of course you can say short and long or long and short they're both the same and for while we put long action with the long action using while of course in real life they could be interchangeable that means you can use them for both cases but at this moment and because you are at the beginner's level so you should find it easier to remember the rules like this first. <laughs> and that is the end of today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and you understand how to use when and while. When you're enjoying the game, don't forget to use when and while to describe your characters 
to your friends and your family. If you like this video, if you learned something in this video, don't forget to like, leave a comment, and also share this video to your friends. And of course, if you want to be the first one to know about my new videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, press the bell button so that you will be the first one to know it. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you very soon. Bye!